Hey guys, so today, um, I thought I'd do a get to know me challenge. It's not exactly a challenge, but it sounds a lot cooler if I call it a challenge, and it kind of sounds like there's more point to it if I call it a challenge. So we're gonna call it a challenge. Um, first of all, yes, my hair is down because my hair tie broke, and I can't find another one right now. But let's get started. It's like really easy questions and really boring ones, so I might find another one and then like make this video longer. But let's not see how this goes. Okay, name. Kaylee White, if you haven't figured that out by the name of the channel, it's just Kaylee White. Uh, height, I am 5 foot 3 and a half inches. I'm really short compared to all my friends, because they're all like 5, 7. That's ridiculous. Wait, next question. Age, 16. Uh, actually 16 and a half. Um, I'm officially 16 and a half on April 11th, which is cool. 16 and a half. No, I don't have my permit. I, I was going to get it, but then I realized that I really don't want to drive. I, I'm terrified of driving. I don't want to crash. Birthday, 10 11 99, which, was, which is actually like a really cool birthday, because in 2012, my birthday was on 10 11 12, and I turned 13, which is pretty freaking cool, and I had a great day that day. That was a good birthday. Uh, girl BFF. I have so many girl BFFs, it's not even funny. Like... I'll, everyone's always like, oh, I have this one person who's my best friend out of everyone. I can't pick a best friend, because I love them all so much. There's Kirsten, and Nikki, and Katie, and Kenzie, and Ashley, and Madison, and Sierra, and all those other people that I love so much, and I just can't pick a favorite one. So if I didn't list you off on that random list, I'm sorry. I still love you, I promise. Uh, Guy BFF? Um, I don't know. Uh, probably either Tyler or Jaden, because they're my favorite guys, which is, I, I guess, counts as a guy best friend. Crush. I actually don't have a crush on anybody right now, which is kind of disappointing on my part. Like, in my own opinion, I find it disappointing, because I really wish I liked somebody right now, but I just don't. I mean, if somebody's attracted to me, I might develop a crush on them, but they're not, so... <sighs> I guess not. Ever fall in love? Um... Yeah, it's not something I want to get into in this video. Maybe in a different one. Like this video, if you want to know more about the time I fell in love, I guess. Um, I fell in love with chocolate, if that counts for anything. Favorite food? Chocolate. <laughs> last text. Last actual text was to my great aunt, because she wanted me to find her on Facebook, but I told her that I couldn't find her. And the last message I sent over Facebook was to Nikki, I think. Let me check. Pull up her message. Yep. <laughs> Send it to her. <sighs> Nikki is awesome, by the way. Longest relationship. Sorry, I couldn't find my place. Um, my longest relationship was a year and three months. That's... It seems like a pretty long time, but it was middle school, mostly. So, it doesn't... Like, middle school relationships never mean anything, for the most part. Like, I know some people are like, Oh, I've had a middle school relationship that meant a lot to me. None of my middle school relationships really meant a whole lot. I mean, my first middle school relationship was with my friend Seth, and it wasn't really a relationship. It was like, he was my best friend, and I was his best friend, and he asked me out, and I thought he was kidding. So I said yes, and then he always said that we were dating, and I thought he was just kidding, and I'd go along with it. We were dating. <laughs> I dated him for like seven months, and then one day he said he was breaking up with me, and then I realized that we were actually dating, and I got really sad. <laughs> and I, I like started crying. And I had an asthma attack because I couldn't breathe. And it was really bad. So my first boyfriend, I didn't even really know I had. Which, he doesn't know that. So if you're watching this, Seth, I'm sorry. I didn't really, really know we were dating. I thought we were kidding. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's horrible. And then my second relationship, which was my longest relationship, was with this other guy. I'm not going to say his name because he hates me now and he'll probably sue me for something. But, I mean, okay, he was my friend in 8th grade. And we were best friends. We, like, we became best friends. In the way that I thought he was pretty cool, so I hung out with him, and he absolutely adored me, so he followed me everywhere. And then one day he asked me out, and he was my friend, so I said, sure. And then we became best friends. And then it didn't exactly go the way I'd wanted it to. Like, it kind of went south, and we stopped talking. So I was going to break up with him around, like, the end of January of that, of my eighth grade year. Beginning of February, that that kind of thing, like around Valentine's Day. 
and then he started bringing me chocolate every day. He'd bring me a chocolate bar. And I was like, you know, maybe I can stay with him a little longer. Maybe our relationship, hi, um, Addy just sent me a message. Maybe, I kept thinking, like, maybe our relationship will go back. Maybe it'll come back, because he seemed to really like me. And so we stayed together, and then summer came, and I was like, okay, well, there's no point in breaking up with him now, because I'll still see him over the summer, because I know where he lives, and I went over to his house a whole bunch of times. So we would, like, hang out and watch Harry Potter, and we, we kissed and stuff. We did all that. Not, like, all that, but you know what I mean. We, we kissed a lot, but it, it just, it didn't feel real. And then to make a long drama story short, in around the end of November, I was at a party, and my friend kissed me, and he got really mad. It wasn't my fault, but he broke up with me, which I'm okay with, because it didn't really get better. It got, like, it felt okay, because I, I hadn't had much relationship experience. So I thought it would always turn around whenever it got bad or we got into a fight or anything, but it didn't. So, ladies, there's a little lesson for you. It, it probably won't. Like, if your relationship's going downhill, it probably will not get better. Like, once it starts going, it's probably gone. There's no point in hanging on to a relationship for over a year if it's not going well. I learned that the hard way. Oh, well. Okay, that was a long one. Sorry for the rant. I just thought it was an interesting story. Um, next question. I have to find my place. Okay, battery percentage. Um, on the iPad that I have the questions that I'm answering up on, it's 13% and it's probably going to die because I'm stupid and I don't charge it. And then my phone, I also don't bother to charge ever. So it's at like 30%. It was at 38 about half an hour ago and I've been using it a lot. So probably around 30 percent. <sighs> eye color. My eye color is actually brown, but it likes to change a lot. Like, when I'm happy, it'll be like a darker brown, and when I'm sad, they'll be like gray, and when I'm excited, they'll be like a brownish green color. So my eyes like to change color, and it's really weird, and I don't know if that's normal. Facebook notification. Okay, I can worry about that later. So, yeah, it likes to change, but primarily brown. Brown most of the time, because I'm almost always happy. At least I'm trying to be. That was sad. That went downhill. Stop talking, Kaylee. Um, let's see. Addiction. Um, I don't do drugs, so I don't have an addiction to anything bad. Um, I would have to say Broadway musicals. I have a pretty bad addiction to Broadway, I would say. Favorite song. It's from the Broadway musical Wicked, I think. No, it's a tie between one from Wicked and one from Phantom of the Opera. My favorite one from Wicked is For Good. It's the last song they sing, and it's so pretty. And I just love it so much, and it makes me think of, like, all my friends. And I want to sing it at my high school graduation. Like, not just me solo, but me and somebody else. That'd be pretty cool. And then my other favorite song is Music of the Night from Phantom of the Opera, which I'm planning on doing a cover of today. So you might hear me sing it later on today. I'm not sure yet. Let's see. Favorite animal. It's called an axolotl. I'll show you guys a little picture of it here. Look at how cute it is. I love axolotls. They're adorable. Let's see. Favorite color. Black. Because it goes with everything and I don't have to put effort into my outfit. Hmm. Sing in the shower. I don't sing. I perform. Whenever I take a shower, I put on a playlist of on YouTube of like a Broadway musical. Most of the time it's either Book of Mormon or Avenue Q. But... I freaking perform. I act out all the songs. I sing all the songs. Like a full Broadway show there. Just why my show is taking too long. One wish. Um, I think if I had one wish, I would wish for to always have the exact amount of money that I need to pay for something at the time. Because not only could I go on an awesome trip to the Hot Topic, I could freaking pay my mom's bills and have all the money that I need to, and then I wouldn't have to worry about running out of money. Like... I wouldn't abuse it personally. I would, like, try to help people with it. Like, if one of my friends was struggling to pay her cell phone bill or something, I could help her with that because I'd have enough money. And, yeah, that's what I'd do. Best time in your life? Anytime I've been on a stage. I love theater. I love performing. Anytime I've been on a stage is the greatest time of my life. Country you live in? Well, considering I just posted a picture on Instagram saying hashtag Viva La France, um, I don't live
live in France or I live in America. Pets! Max, say hi. Hi, Max. Hi, Maxie. Hi, Max. Yep, that's my dog. Her name is Maximum Ride. After the awesome book series that nobody's ever heard of. What are you doing? She's trying to lick me. Hi, Max. Other than that, I have, like, goldfish and stuff, but there are, like, ten of them, and I don't give them names. And I have pet snails, but I think they're dead. I don't know. They're, like, garden snails. Like, I went out and got them out of, like, trees, and I keep them in a little tank, but they don't like to move a whole lot, so I can never really tell if they're alive. That's weird. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, plan on getting married? Maybe. Maybe someday. Maybe to a girl. Maybe to a boy. I'm not sure yet. Depends on how life works out. Favorite subject? Chorus! <laughs> because chorus is awesome. I'm gonna have to go really quick now, because this video went a lot longer than I wanted it to. First kiss of my second boyfriend. It was really sloppy and really ugly, and it was horrible, and I never want to kiss like that again in my life. Um, am I insecure? Yes, I am. Ever self-harmed? That's for another video. Who you love? Uh, Max. Max, do you love me? She just whined at me. I'll take that as a no. Thanks, Max. I uh, miss anyone. I miss my granddad, because he died before I was born, and I never got to meet him. And, I don't know. If I had two wishes, that'd be my second wish, to, like, have even an hour to hang out with him. That'd be freaking awesome. <laughs> miss you, granddad. Um, hair color. Brown! <laughs> Relationship status. Chubby, single, and ready for a Pringle. Last song you heard. Um, Jacksepticeye's outro song, because I just watched the Jacksepticeye video before recording this, so. Jack, if you're watching my video somehow, I love you. Sorry. Um, biggest fear. Um, actually, my biggest fear is doing something to make God hate me, which, should I get into this a little bit? I'm going to get into this just a little bit. I'm always afraid that, like, I'll do something really bad, and he'll stop forgiving me. That's my biggest fear, to not be forgiven by God anymore, which I know isn't, is, they say it's not going to happen, but my biggest fear is what if it does? What if one day he just stops forgiving me for all of my sin? I don't know. That's my biggest fear. Believe in ghosts. Yes, and I have seen ghosts because there's a haunted hotel that my mom's friend used to own. It's freaking creepy, and we go on ghost hunts all the time. Something you hate. I don't, like hate a lot of people. I don't hate people, first of all, and I don't hate a lot of things, but I guess I hate broccoli, sorry, and I hate people are rude. I don't hate rude people, because I know there's good in them somewhere, but I hate rudeness. Knock it off, bro! Favorite TV show, Castle, so murder mystery show, it's awesome. <sighs> Favorite movie... I have a lot of favorite movies. I like movies. Uh, favorite book? Harry Potter and the Deathly Hollows. The greatest book ever. Favorite food? Chocolate. Jealous of? Nobody. Star sign? Libra. Middle name? Jean. Worst habit? Um, second guessing myself? A lot. <laughs> Number of siblings? Four. Name of siblings? Jordan, Aaron, Ashley, Nathan. Sports you play? Fun fact! I was a varsity basketball cheerleader my freshman year of high school. I didn't do it my sophomore year because I was in the hospital the week of tryouts. Teardrop. I think. No, I was going to do wrestling cheer instead, but I was in the hospital that week. I didn't try out for basketball cheer because um, I was at a play and it was dress rehearsal week. And I didn't want to like miss and get yelled at by my director, so I didn't try out. It's okay, though. I'm kind of over it. But I got my letter, so that counts. About varsity. Sorry, I just like to bring that up all the time because a lot of time people are like, "Do you just band or do you play a sport?" And like, actually, I was a varsity basketball cheerleader, <laughs> and I was on varsity cheerleading my middle school years. Um, talents. <clears throat> Whoa. Talents. Um, I don't think I'm very good at a lot of things, but I like acting and I like singing, and in the act. In, like, theater, I like dancing, and I like playing tuba. Yay. Embarrassing moment. My entire life. Future career choice. Broadway actress. 
Okay, that's all of the questions. This video went a lot longer than I wanted it to, but I hope you're okay with that. Um, if you like this video, please make sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe because I try to make new videos every single day. I try really hard. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Stay awesome. Bye!